think one thing that's really important is the whole message of do not judge a book by its cover. So many of our kids who do not have the ability to communicate are misjudged. We assess the child's ability to function in their everyday life. Can they get themselves dressed? Can they feed themselves? Can they play? There's social skills with each other. So many parents come to me and say, well, my child isn't interested in a lot of things, but she loves music. And I say, yes, pretty much every child that has ever come in the doors of Zerenu loves music. And having something that they really want to do and that engages their attention makes it much more possible for us to achieve the goals we have for the child. This is gonna be the good life. This is gonna be the good life. This could really be a good life. Good life. Say, oh, got this feeling that you can fight like this city is on fire tonight. This could really be a good life. A good, good life. Technology is huge. For this particular child, using her hands to communicate is not reasonable expectation. And the machine is calibrated to her eye gaze so that if she looks a certain length of time, it will say whatever's on that symbol. We're dealing with children who are at risk or who have been diagnosed with conditions where we know their motor development will be delayed. We pride ourselves on having a transdisciplinary team, which means we all work together to treat the whole child. We're always talking with each other, we're always communicating with each other. It's not like speech is more important than physio is more important. It's not. Like we definitely work together and support each other's goals in as natural a way as possible and that's really important for the child. Research has shown us that early intervention is a necessity in helping these children develop. We are working on giving them the ability to be able to call attention. Some kids can't use their voices. If they can hit the switch and say, I need some help, that's a really important thing for them to be able to do. We're always assessing their ability throughout the entire school year. We're always looking to see how they're improving and how they're changing. We've had people come and base their treatment models on Zarenu from Israel, France, Montreal. They've set up schools without as much therapy, but they've modeled it after this one. Say, oh, got this feeling that you can't.